you can send me music via the Introducing Uploader and um, that's bbc.co.uk slash introducing that's where I listen to the majority of the music and uh, if you want to send me maybe like a press pack as well as the music you can get me on my email address that is gemma.bradley at bbc.co.uk and that's Gemma with a G. The easiest way to send me music is either through the BBC Introducing Uploader, it's an amazing resource and I pull from it all the time, or you can send me music directly to my music submissions email, that's shanpresents at gmail.com. The best way to get music to me is by BBC Introducing and the Uploader, or send it me on email, it's musicforvictoriajane at gmail.com. All letters, no numbers. So I guess one of my top tips would be for when you're using the BBC Introducing Uploader to make sure you kind of nail your description, your profile, tell me a bit about you, your influences, where you're from, don't say I, I live here, where is here, um, you know, um, so things like that, you know, maybe add something a little bit more fun in there. Once somebody told me they worked at Subway and I was like, deadly, great, I will remember that for the rest of my life now. Um, and it's a random fact, but I loved it. So definitely like that and you want to make it stand out as well. Um, another top tip is just be you, be your authentic self. I love to hear that in people's music and also in interactions, you know, um, because I'm a human, you're a human, I want to get to know you, you know, as well as the music, so that would be another top tip. And when you're sending me music, you know, because we are on a national level, Radio 1, we want to make sure that production and things like that, um, it's up to scratch, so maybe don't record it on a phone, you know. And I know that's really obvious, but sometimes it's best just to have that cleaner sound. For me, the easiest way to get to music on the radio is to have a genuine belief in your sound. So if you're completely sold on you as a brand, as a musician, as a band, as a collective, then I can rally behind that as well, whether that is your social media presence, your perfectly crafted email to me telling me that you love the shows that I'm on and you think this would fit really well with everything else that we play, giving me a little bit of information about you and then a lovely little Dropbox link to your music and I can really rally behind you and get your name on air. I would say be yourself, you want to be different, you want, uh, I want to hear how you're different from the rest, how your R&B soul and your soul, um, alternative R&B music is different from the rest, I want to hear how you sound distinct, your lyricism is distinct, um, I don't really like long intros because I want to get as much new music in on my show, so make your intro short as possible, really. Um, but on an email, when I'm looking at emails, I want everything to be there. MP3s, WAVs, photo, uh, links to socials, because sometimes I'm loving a song and I don't know who to tag. So links to socials um, and info about you. Uh, I want to know about you and what makes you tick, basically, the person behind the song.